I think you had enough to drink now. That's five shots now. I'm sure there's more than enough to get you swaying in your seat. Everyone in the office knows you're a lightweight. Yeah, yeah. I'm helping you not embarrass yourself. You'll thank me later. You want me to, uh, dance now? With me? Uh, you're half drunk and there are too many people watching. If you start moving too much, you're going to end up puking everywhere. Like last year at the New Year's Eve party. <sighs> I'd rather not see that again if I can help it. No. <sighs> Fine, but I'm leaving if you start looking green. These shoes are brand new, okay? Brand new. If you get them dirty, you're buying me a new pair. Oh, you think I won't leave? Pretty sure you don't need me to babysit you? Okay, so we happen to live in the same direction and frequent the same social circles. But it's not like I'm following you around or anything. stalker. It's just a series of unfortunate coincidences. Oh, come on. That was one time. I just had to make sure you made it home safely. What's wrong with that? Doesn't mean I'm your official babysitter. At least they get paid. In fact, you should be grateful I always keep an eye out for you. Who knows what could be lurking out there, waiting for you. Haven't you heard the news? Lots of kidnapping cases lately. People going missing left and right, especially around this area. It's very dangerous. Anyway, weren't you going to dance? You're looking a little wobbly there. Oh, careful there! Wouldn't want you to smash that pretty face of yours against the floor. You okay? <laughs> I don't think you're in any condition to dance. Want to get some fresh air instead? Alright. I'll walk you out. Let me tell the others we'll be leaving soon. <laughs> I don't really mind leaving early. It's alright. Can I tell you a secret? I hate these outings. They're boring. And the majority of people in our office are too old for it to not be awkward. Feels like I'm going out with a bunch of relatives. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know I'm popular and they like me. Doesn't mean I have to like them back, though. I'm just polite. Being nice and helpful goes a long way, you know? Everyone loves the goody two-shoes, especially when there's money involved. Why do you think I get so many sales? <laughs> Are you jealous of me? I'm not going to judge you for it. It's basic human nature to want what others have. You see my popularity and my achievements, and you can't help but compare yourself to me. Oh, there's no need to deny it so adamantly. I know you keep an eye on my every move. And I also know you've been working extra hard to catch up to me. Yes, of course I've noticed. The extra hours, the extra effort. You even work from home when you don't really have to. <laughs> it's what made me notice you in the first place. You're the first one to openly challenge me for my position like this. And I like it. You're diligent, a quick learner, and earnest. If I wasn't around, my position would be yours. What a shame, huh? I wonder, are you this earnest in other aspects of your life? This is an admirable trait. Ah, it's 
seems like we're not alone. I told you, this area is especially dangerous at night. Now, don't make any sudden movements. Uh, hello there. Do you need help? You look quite sick. <laughs> Whoa there! If I didn't know better, I swear you're trying to rip my heart out. And I know that's not the case. Because even a newborn like you should know better than to approach an art demon in plain sight. <laughs> oh, you're interested in my companions, what? I'm afraid that's one human you shouldn't target me. Listen, I'm trying to be nice here, giving you a fair warning and all, which is more than any of my fellow Arc-E demons would do, especially the glutton guarding this human. So why don't you do both of us a favor and kindly fuck off? You smell like death. Ugh. You newborn vampires are disgusting. Not even bothering to clean up after Moloch's one. Where are you, mindless animal? <sighs> Fine. Don't say I didn't warn you. Well, that was embarrassing. Hope you don't judge me too hard for it. <clears throat> uh, where were we before the interruption? Why do you look so surprised? I know gluttony has been following you around for years now. Won't shut up about how delicious your soul is. You know of our existence already, so why the wide eyes? <laughs> oh, right, right, the vampire. Uh, yeah. That one was a mindless newborn. They attack anything with a pulse, pretty much. Seems like there's an elder going around turning humans for some reason. Building an army, perhaps? Who knows? I guess our presence in this city is making these other races pretty nervous. <laughs> you didn't know that? Yeah. Vampires, werewolves, demons, witches, any other supernatural creature you could think of. All real. We mind our own business, though, which is why humans are clueless most of the time. Oh, you want a proper introduction too, I guess. I'm Envy. Real old name is a secret, as usual. But if you look me up online, I'm sure you'll find plenty of other names to call me by. I won't bore you with the spiel. <laughs> the real reason why I notice you? Well, you see, Gluttony and I have a little bet going on behind the scenes. Can't you give any details, Dale? Let's say I was curious. I'm very curious by nature. If one of my fellow Ark Demons is so very interested in something, I just need to check it out for myself, you know? So what the fuss is about? <laughs> now I understand why. Your soul is a very delectable thing, indeed. It's like you're begging to be eaten at this point. If you don't even know it. No wonder the glutton's so busy keeping all these hungry vampires and imps off you. You're a damn beacon, sweetheart. Plus, this little competition we got going on in the workplace, it fuels me like no other. You're envy. Your jealousy. I fucking love it. Your emotions are so incredibly strong. You sure know how to feed us well. So, expect to see me around often. Now, let's get you home. Yes? You can barely walk straight. And you're starting to look a bit... Green. In the face. <laughs> I told you. These shoes are brand new, sweetheart. So think twice before opening that pretty mouth of yours. <laughs> <laughs>